Hello, everyone. I hope you've had a great week. Um, as you might be able to tell, I've switched days to Friday, so I will be posting every week on Friday now. Um, and this week we are talking about how to meet other queer people and befriend them. I, I, I haven't had a lot of experience with this, um, kind of until college. Um, and what I mean by that is I've always had friends who, um, are queer, but I never seem to have ever seek them out. Um, it just happens that, um, all of my male friends are gay. It just happens that way. But um, as I went to college, um, I definitely attempted to um, find more queer people, people I could relate to, people I could talk to. Something that just made that even easier is I've always, I've always been in theater. And um, I don't want this to sound stereotypical, but um, theater happens to be a more accepting place. And so you tend to find a lot more um, queer people within theater um, because it is so accepting of all different kinds of people. So um, my high school uh, had a gay straight alliance. It was um, made the year I came there, um, which was only the second year of the school. Um, I never uh, joined the gay straight alliance, but um, I I was kind of there at the beginning of it because I knew the people who started it. And I definitely think that that is a great way to um, not only um, make other queer friends, but also, um, you know, start getting involved, um, to start getting involved in uh, the queer community and um, start learning about queer issues and... Um, you know, really kind of realizing that there are other people out there that are just like you. And it's a great place to be able to talk about, you know, the experiences that you're having, um, the issues that you're going through. Um, and if your school doesn't, uh, doesn't allow you to have a GSA, A, shame on them, and B, Start a drama club if they won't let you start a GSA. Um, because like I said, theater is a really accepting place and a lot of queer people tend to uh, flock to theater. Um, so a great way to disguise your GSA from um, phobic uh, administration is a drama club. But in uh, my college and Jeffrey's college, uh, um, we have a queer resource center um, where they put on events for National Coming Out Day. They have a float in our Pride Parade. Um, you know, they do small events throughout the year. They host dances. Um, they have a drag show. Um, and, you know, whenever I go down there, which is not very often, but it's going to be more often this year, I promise. Uh, that's a resolution I made. Um... You know, everyone just hangs out that, down there, and everyone seems to know each other. Everyone understands that this is the community at our school, um, which is really great. And it's, um, it's a little scary, uh, but it seems just like such a welcoming place. Um, and so, I mean, if you're lucky enough at whatever university you go to to have... Um, some kind of resource center, if you have a gay straight alliance at your university, um, if, if you want to start one, if your school doesn't have one, and that, that is absolutely a way to meet people, you know, be the person that gets the ball rolling and start one. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say about that. Um, See you next week.